Hello YouTube, thank you for stopping by. As always, please click like if you happen to enjoy this video. Please click on subscribe, and if you would like to be notified when I publish future videos, just click on that bell-shaped notify button. Additionally, I'd love to hear from you, so be sure to leave me a comment, and please share this video with anyone you think might also like it. Alrighty then. This is a really short video that shows a quick and easy way to convert the most common type of proprietary OEM computer monitor stand into a universal computer monitor stand. It's so easy that it's a bit silly, actually. So let's just get to it. Anybody that um, works with computers uh, has probably had a situation where they've had to swap out a monitor stand for a different type of monitor stand, or maybe it's an arm that uh, is hanging on a, uh, a cubicle wall or something. Long story short, uh, we often discard these uh, extra monitor stands uh, at work because they're more or less proprietary. This one's, um, I don't remember what this one is. I think they're all made by the same Japanese or Chinese company. Um, these three are Dell. This one's actually uh, from a Samsung. Uh, and I don't remember what this one is, but it's a little different. Um, anyways, long story short, they're all proprietary in that they've got these tabs on the top edge and two screws on the bottom. But of course, the tabs from different monitor companies, uh, different monitor manufacturers and models are different. So they're not interchangeable completely, um, unless of course you've got the same uh, device model. Well. When looking at this particular style of uh, monitor stand, uh, I don't know, maybe over a year ago, I noticed that this one was actually, the metal plate was pre-drilled with holes so that in principle, if you drilled it out, you could use it with any monitor because the monitors all have four screw holes. There, there, there are sometimes different sizes. Some are, are uh, bigger, especially on the heavier monitors, uh, but they always have the smaller uh, four-hole pattern as well, all of them. I haven't seen a single monitor yet that didn't have screw holes for four screws. Even though the factory um, monitor stand only has two screws and these two tabs, for whatever reason, uh, the monitors themselves always have four screw holes from what I can remember seeing. It, it boggles my mind why they would go to this, unless, I, I guess, it's cheaper than two more screws, maybe? I, I don't know. I don't get it. Uh, but anyway, so, so this one here is a real easy modification because we've already got the whole spaces marked. All we have to do is, is break off these, these tabs, drill a couple holes through the plastic, and this one's done. The others are a little bit more complicated in that we don't have the uh, additional two screw holes um, marked. But fortunately, making a template is as easy as cutting a piece of paper to size, marking where two screws are, flip it around, mark it again, and boom, you've got a template that you can mark and drill. And, and I've actually verified it on, on this one over here, um, which is out of the camera. I'm, so anyways, the, my, my little cheap-ass template uh, lines up just fine. So anyways, if you want to know how to convert these proprietary monitor stands 
into a universal monitor stand. I just explained it, but stay tuned. We're going to do that right now. Like I said, there's not much to it. Break off the metal tabs, mark and drill a couple 3 16 inch holes, a little bit of cleanup, and you're done. Okay, I guess that's it for this video. Remember, please click like if you happened to enjoy this video. If you haven't done so already, I'd really appreciate it if you would please click on subscribe. And if you would like to be notified when I publish future videos, just click on that bell-shaped notify button. Additionally, I'd love to hear from you. So be sure to leave me a comment and please share this video with anyone you think might like it as well. Bye for now. Please.